what's going on everybody Rob here so I got the plants they're all ready to go outside well virtually almost all of them but I don't really need all of them there's too much that came in this year let me show you the yellow bells the romas are ready to go outside I did buy these from the store Tabasco's because I didn't have any uh, let's see I got some uh, bell peppers back there look at that that's how good the ginger's doing cucumbers those are avocados with avocados it'll take like seven years for them to give you a fruit unless you graft it after a year you could graft it onto another tree then they'll fruit sooner let me show you how see they're drying out because i don't over water them they're not in the greenhouse so they don't have their own water so let's go make their food so this is my worm bin right here tons of worms in here look how good that soil is tons of worm in here how good the soil is i gotta moist, moisten it a little bit and refeed them but at the bottom of it you see my little tray it dipped in right there so i gotta lift it up a little bit because it bent in but this is all worm tea when i put the water in this barrel right here at the top just a little bit that's what comes out the bottom but i don't give it fully this strength i put a quarter of it in another jug and then fill it with fish tank water so you see i got some worm tea in there I just get a bottle or whatever I put it in my fish tank and then I get fish tank water to fill the rest of it up so I do cycle this a lot because I pull water out and then I add water in from the tap now that down there is the best worm tea that you're ever gonna get some worm tea mixed with some fish tank water so I'm gonna shake it up really good and then we're gonna feed all these plants right here all right, then just put it in there. Try to get it. The, all these have holes in the bottom, but this is like the best food ever for your plants. So I got to move some around. I can't really do it with one hand, but uh, you know, I let them dry out pretty much. I don't want to overwater them. But then now if you put miracle Grow does work really good also, but if you get any miracle Grow on the leaves, you're going to burn the leaves, even if it's diluted. So that's my worm tea for my worm plants they're all ready to go outside 